Sure, beer is the world's favorite bar drink, but it's also killing it in the kitchen. Jackie Denker is whipping up some tasty dishes where beer's golden touch is making good food great. It's time to get some food brewing, literally. When I go to a party, I usually bring a six pack, but maybe I should bring a six pack into the kitchen too. Absolutely. And why is that? Well, just like cooking with wine or any other spirit, it's always nice to actually impart some of the flavors. We brought the party to Petal House Brewery in Phoenix, Arizona, where culinary director Harmon Swartz showed me some bar fare where beer is the star. So it turns up our meals. That's absolutely right. While we're getting turned up. <laughs> First up, a British pub staple, beer battered fish. I'm gonna create a little bit of the tempura batter. In a bowl, combine all-purpose flour, cornstarch, and seasoning, which is made of onion powder, garlic powder, and salt. That's our flavor. Yeah, that's I can flavor. smell that. Yeah. In goes an egg, whisk, and slowly add in the hops. We used their beer blanche, which is a Belgian wheat. Beer is gonna activate a little Activate! Bit. Yes. And Dunk your fish. He uses cod, which absorbs the beer nicely. Then into an oiled pan or fryer until golden brown on both sides. And of course, pair with your favorite Belgian wheat beer. Mmm, that is so good. Right? Move over, Gouda, because up next, we made beer cheese. So this is a great basic cheese. In a stock pot over medium heat, make a roux. Melt the butter down, add the flour in, and then mix it up really well. Then you add in your beer, water, heavy cream, and let that cook down. And so at home, can we use any beer? Absolutely. Reds are great, pale ales, pilsners. Once your roux is cooked down, use an immersion blender and blend away while you slowly add your cheese. He went with sharp cheddar and American white. And serve. To wash it down, a hazy IPA that will contrast nicely with the beer cheese. Oh, MG. Finally, beer brats. All you gotta do is pour the beer over your brats and let it sit overnight. We went with their Mexican Amber, which is a Vienna lager. And at home, he suggests we use... Anything that has a little bit more of a, a heavier body to it. More uh, hops. Yep, hops. Yeah, stouts are great. Let them simmer in beer over medium heat until they get a bit of color. Throw them on the grill and enjoy on a charcuterie board or in a sandwich. Mm. Right. Mm. Here's to drinking our food as we learn to cook with beer.